Hollywood is a glamorous world. If you're lucky enough to become a successful star, then you can have just about anything you want, from giant mansions to legions of adoring fans. However, being launched from obscurity to dizzying heights of fame isn't always as easy as you might think, especially if you're a child star. After all, it's an enormous amount of pressure to have on your shoulders, and more often than not, they go off the rails, leaving their reputation and career in bits. Let's take a look at 10 Famous Child Celebs Who Ruined Their Career Number 10. Stephen Anthony Lawrence American actor Stephen Anthony Lawrence had the world at his feet when he landed the role of Bernard Bean's Aaron Gurin in the smash hit Disney show Even Stevens. Although the role only lasted a couple of years, Lawrence had a pretty successful run starring in other shows such as That's So Raven, Married, With Children, and feature films Cheaper by the Dozen and Kicking and Screaming to name but a few. All in all, he had a promising career in front of him. Unfortunately, it didn't quite work out that way. In 2015, fans started posting pictures of Lawrence in his latest role as Santa's helper at Sun Valley Mall. The star was barely recognizable and has definitely aged so much that it's not hard to see why the 27-year-old actor is out of work. Let's hope that there's enough jobs at the North Pole to keep him going for a while. Number 9. Winona Ryder While Winona Ryder was once one of Hollywood's hottest, the Edward Scissorhands star had a highly publicized fall from Greg's in 2001, when she was caught stealing over $5,000 worth of designer clothes from Sakes Fifth Avenue in Beverly Hills. The incident was quickly leaked to the media, and the whole world saw the security footage of Ryder stealing the goods. During the trial, prosecutors accused the 90 star of using a variety of drugs illegally, including Oxycontin, Valium, and Vicodin. In December 2002, she was convicted of grand theft, shoplifting, and vandalism and sentenced to three years probation and 480 hours of community service. Ryder did manage to work through her issues and land consistent roles, but it wasn't until she backed herself a main role on the uber-popular Netflix series Stranger Things that she was fully accepted back into the fold. That was a close one, Winona. Number 8. Tom Cruise One of the most successful actors to ever grace our screens, Tom Cruise started his career at the tender age of 19 in the 1981 feature film Endless Love. Since then, he's been the lead in many successful blockbusters, most notably the Mission Impossible franchise. However, things may be about to change. During the filming of American Maid, two pilots were killed. Alan Perwin and Carlos Burrell perished when the small twin-engine plane they were flying went down in bad conditions on location in Colombia. According to the lawsuit filed by the pair's separate estates earlier this year, Cruz and director Doug Lyman are largely to blame. After repeatedly adding entire scenes and aerial shots without warning, an executive producer voiced his concerns at the time, saying it was some of the most insane stuff he ever had to deal with. The families do not directly name Cruz or Lyman as defendants in the suit, but claim that the cocktail star could have flown the plane himself, as he is a qualified and experienced pilot. According to them, the flight was a spontaneous, rushed, ad hoc mission on unfamiliar terrain in unfamiliar weather from a small jungle airstrip. Undoubtedly, Cruz's reputation has been tarnished beyond repair. Number 7. Shia LaBeouf Shia LaBeouf had a wide variety of roles as a kid, playing Louis Stevens and Even Stevens alongside her first entry, Stephen Anthony Lawrence, as well as in feature films. His successful career went on as he landed the role of Sam Witwicky in the Transformers franchise along Megan Fox, which was a commercial hit. But sometimes, the pressure is just too much for superstars, and they simply crack. Things started going awry in 2014 when LaBeouf was charged with disorderly conduct and criminal trespass at Studio 54. His behavior definitely didn't resemble that of a Disney star when he spat at officers, swore, and yelled all the way to the station. While he attended rehab after the incident, a similar occurrence happened in July of 2017, where LaBeouf launched a horrible tirade of abuse against officers who tried to detain him in Savannah, Georgia, on the grounds of public intoxication. He was subsequently sentenced to a year's probation, fined $1,000, and is required to attend anger management. It's no surprise, given this behavior, that Shia isn't on our screens anymore. 
instead choosing to go down the performance art route. If you ever catch one of his shows, be sure to turn your cell phone off. You don't want to anger this guy. Do it! Just do it! Number 6. Kendall Jenner You might be wondering why the uber-famous Kendall Jenner is on this list, but bear with us. Part of the tremendously popular Kardashian-Jenner clan, there's hardly anyone in the world who doesn't know who the older Jenner sister is. A successful supermodel and reality star, there was a time when young girls everywhere wanted to be just like her. Sadly for Kendall, she made a disastrous career choice earlier this year when she agreed to star in a Pepsi commercial. The advertisement, entitled Live For Now, sees her using a can of the beverage to make a truce between police officers and protesters. Upon its release, it was highly criticized for making light of important issues such as the Black Lives Matter movement and police brutality. The ad was pulled within 24 hours. Pepsi issued a formal apology, including one to Kendall, but maintained that she had the right to approve it before it was released. Many also speculated on her silence throughout the scandal, wondering why she hadn't apologized at all, although it was later discovered that her contract prohibited her from speaking out on the issue. Regardless of what went wrong here, Kendall lost a plethora of fans and respect for making such a careless career move. Number 5. Justin Bieber Regardless if you hate him or if you're a die-hard believer, you can't deny that pop star Bieber is one of the biggest names in the industry today. He had his first hit with the annoyingly catchy Baby when he was just 16 years old. Although he had the face of an angel, he's now notorious for his bad boy shenanigans. Even early on in his career, Bieber wasn't the nicest to his fans, often telling them to go away when they asked for autographs or selfies. Last year, the star released a statement saying, It has gotten to the point that people won't even say hi to me or recognize me as a human. I want to be able to keep my sanity. I realize people will be disappointed, but I don't owe anybody a picture. Couple that with his brushes with the law following a DUI and vandalism among other things, and the sweet-faced Prince of Pop has definitely gone rogue. He seems to be holding on for now, but time will only tell how this one will pan out. Our bet? It won't be pretty. Number 4. Adam Levine Lead singer of Maroon 5, Levine may seem like the epitome of nice. After all, he's an expert at writing love songs. The reality is quite different. One fan was left disgruntled and burning all of her CDs. According to one Reddit user, his girlfriend approached Levine, super excited to get an autograph from one of her favorite singers. Rather than agreeing and happily signing, Levine reportedly said, I don't give autographs to ugly chicks before walking away. That's not the only story out there of the singer being less than gentlemanly either. As a judge on The Voice, audiences just assumed that his no-nonsense persona was simply an act. Unfortunately not. It's this kind of behavior that ruins careers and alienates fan bases. Number 3. Iggy Azalea Some of these stars might seem infallible but they land themselves in hot water through the wonderful world of Twitter. Rap sensation Iggy Azalea is notorious for being outspoken, but she's also notorious for being a keyboard warrior. We've lost count of the amount of feuds Iggy has conjured up out of thin air. In 2011, she tried to start an argument with Krayshawn, constantly tweeting negative things at her and retweeting ones about her. Krayshawn didn't lower herself and never responded. In the same year, Azalea Banks tweeted her admiration for Iggy. But surprisingly, that escalated into a massive issue too. When asked about her constant Twitter arguments, Azalea maintained that she didn't have a problem with anyone. But the evidence says different. Gone are the days where Iggy was solely known for her music. These days, she's more famous than a cattle farm for the amount of beef she rears. Number 2. Juliana Rose Morelio if you grew up in the 2000s, chances are you'll have seen an episode of the ultra-colorful and quirky Lazy Town. Full of bright characters and annoying songs, pink-haired Stephanie often stole the show. Juliana Rose Morelio played the part until she was deemed too old by producers. According to website Glossy News, Morelio was arrested several times for prostitution and drugs. Although many have called this false information, Morelio herself claims to have never been arrested at all let alone for offenses such as these. A debunked false story? Or just a crafty cover-up from this child actress? 
Who knows, but we'll be watching this space. Number 1. Britney Spears Spears was the picture of innocence in 1998, just 16 years old when Baby One More Time was released. It's not been all sunshine and rainbows for the once pristine starlet. She had more scandals than you can shake a stick at. From the messy breakup with Justin Timberlake due to alleged infidelity to her very public mental breakdown where she shaved her head. It's been a long road for Britney. Due to substance abuse issues, she lost custody of her children to her ex-husband dancer, Kevin Federline, and bounced in and out of rehab. While Brit carried on making music for the entirety of her career, many still fear the singer will have a tragic end. For the moment though, Spears seems to be doing well. Having just finished a residency in Las Vegas and posting numerous photos of her post-workout bod on Instagram. Don't know about you, but we're rooting for her. And that concludes our list for today. Like always, if you enjoyed it, be sure to give us a big thumbs up and leave us some love in the comment section. To keep up to date with all of our awesome videos, be sure to hit subscribe and turn your notifications on to never miss a thing. Until next time, thanks for watching. See you later.